Hello everyone, I'm here today at Midlands Fishery. I'm on the Warren Pond and I'm here to test out the new TriCast Perception XN. Now the uh, Excellence 980 is the new flagship pole on a brave new mandrel uh, which came out last year and with the new mandrel you know a, a cheaper budget pole was always going to be next on the cars. Well I say budget pole you know, we're talking in the one to two grand mark so it's not not a cheap pole but it's certainly not not expensive you know we're talking sort of half the price of the excellence and of course for half the price you would be thinking you're going to get half the performance however you're certainly not with that this pole obviously it hasn't got the quite the same rigidity and balance as the three grand version but it's certainly no slouch for the money you get a pretty comprehensive spares package and a nice fishable 15.8 meter pole like 15.8 meters that's a bit weird do you not think right well that's because tricast they're honest with their pole lengths an awful lot of poles out there that say 16 meters in reality they're not 16 meters they're just shy of it and tricast they're not trying to mug anybody off they're telling you the exact length of that pole and that is 15.8 meters you get quality 15.8 meters for your money now i've got reasonable gear on here just pinging six mil pellets got an eight mil pellet on the hook we've got a yellow midi reactor core elastic you know it's not it's powerful elastic but it's just nice for open water carp number one that's the second time that i've uh, fished with this pole now so i've already done the uh, review for the magazine so let's get out and try and capture some uh, some shots on video it's worth talking about the top kits that come with this pole you get a really good spares package um, you've got the standard length top kits which you know they're all labelled up which is pretty good um, all the second sections of them are all labelled up as number two but to go on the top part of the pole you've got two different tip sections it's the standard one just labelled up one and then the BB which is big bore so you know if you're slight so rather than having separate power kits it's just the one section that you need to swap and they're all labelled up so you're not going to mix them up nice and simple that's what i've got on at the minute one of the big bore tips don't like messing around got good uh, decent elastic in this i want to make sure i'm powered up correctly also with the pole you get um, several one-piece kits like f1 type kits which you know that they're all the rage for uh, smaller species with hollow elastics you know allow you to get the, the fish in a little bit closer net them quicker a little bit less elastic keeps them under control but if you better fish in open water you know standard length top kits gives you a bit more elastic and a bit more stretch all top kits come with reinforced wrap already on them so ready for a side puller to be fitted so they don't come bushed up as as standard but yeah it's, it's not really an issue because you know not everybody likes side pullers you know you can still fit um your own puller bung into the bottom or just uh, it's just a an off-the-shelf drenon bush um i've just got straight off 
out the tackle shop, just slotted it straight into the end. And away we go, ready to elasticate. As well as quite an extensive spares package. You also get a, as you'd expect for the money, a free hold all with it, with all the tubes labelled up and ready to go. You know, they really do like their labelling tricast. Uh, you also get the cupping kit, already glued, thread attached, plus two cups, and even a cap to go with it. So of course, to produce uh, another pole like this on the same uh, mandrel as the top of the range pole, the main reason for that is, you know, if you've got a, th a three grand pole, it's always nice to have a second pole on the same mandrel. Where you know, if you're fishing in real kind of demanding conditions, you're not going to damage or break your, your main pole. Or you know, if you're fishing a festival, the last thing you want to do is, is break a big section on your pole and, and your festival's ruined. So if you've got a slightly cheaper pole on the same mandrel in your bag, you can just slip in a spare section and away you go. Other people will, uh, will want to buy this. You know, just to have a decent pole from a quality UK, UK brand, all UK made. It's just a good standalone pole in its own right. And if at any point you did want to uh, upgrade to the uh, to the excellence, of course, all your top kits are, and stuff like that are going to fit. The other thing you've got to remember when you're investing in a tricast pole is. You're not just buying a pole, you're, you're getting something that's, that's going to last. Not only are they really strong, really well built, but Tricast have an excellent spares policy. And it is not poles out there where you know, companies, they, they change their mandrels so frequently that you know, get a pole that's seven, eight years old, break a section on it, and that's it. You might as well scrap it. You're never going to get another replacement section for it. But Tricast, not only do they keep a wide range of spares for their poles available, but they will even make a spare section on request. Like Tricast, they're, they're UK based, so all their poles are made right in this country. And, and even if they haven't got the section in stock, they will make it for you. you know, they keep all their mandrels and it's not like the section's got to come from China. They'll make it right here in the UK and sometimes they can even turn the section around in, in as little as a week. Yeah, they really do look after their, uh, their customers. The only thing that will ever stop you getting a replacement section for your TriCast pole, you know, even if it's 15 or 20 years old, is not being able to get uh, hold of the materials. Obviously, carbon technology changes all the time. As long as they can get hold of the same carbon cloth, then they will be able to make you a section for your pole. Like, how many other poles on the market after 20 years, would you expect that you might even be able to get a spare section for it? That's, that really is quite, quite something. Hard fighting carp here at Medlands, although they're a little bit more docile today. We had a baking hot week last week and suddenly it's it's cooled down a little. They're a little bit more docile but you know it's still summer. They're still fighting reasonably hard but they're not quite there we are cracking little mirror. They're not quite going absolutely berserk like they were uh, last week. The other thing that you do really like about tricast poles is basically how, how thick and strong all the sections are. Okay, it's not really a great test of strength, you know, just giving the sections a, a squeeze, but uh, 
how thick each section is, how much carbon is in it, and how little flex you actually get. That really is reassuring. It's a tool for doing a job. It's the way I like to think about poles. It's all about, at the end of the day, what it can achieve. There we go. That's a proper one. Look at the bend in that. This pole feels so strong in your hands. It just feels like you can do absolutely anything with it. It does not fail to surprise me how good a pole you can get in the mid-range market now. I'm just wondering how long it's going to be for nobody's going to buy like one of the very top poles anymore because you effectively now have to start paying double the money to get like an extra 10% performance. Oh, for a grand and a half, this pole's absolutely superb. You're not going to find much better for the money. does exactly what you need it to. Right, the TriCast Perception XN, absolutely superb pole for the money. Don't take my word for it. Try it out, have a look at one in your local TriCast stockist.